Hey, what's up guys? Uh, today I'm going to dye my bangs yellow and baby pink. Um, what you're gonna, well the colors that I'm using is uh, Manic Panic's Cotton Candy Pink. And it's really gross looking, sorry. And uh, Manic Panic's Electric Banana. And in my other video you guys knew that I really didn't like the Manic Panic. But what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm going to add a little bit of conditioner and another pink into here. So it will, I don't really have a lot either, so it'll make it a bit better. And I have plenty of yellow. So let me just mix it and I will show you what you need after. So I mixed it and I mixed it right in the container. And I used Color Jam's Whole Head Pink and just some basic conditioner and that's what it looks like and I'm just gonna take my tail comb and mix it up a bit and I will come back when it's done and properly mixed okay so what you're gonna need is your hair dyes um, a clip or a hair tie and a brush so since I'm only doing my bangs, I'm going to brush all my hair forward because I'm going to do like an ombre type thing. So I'm going to brush it forward. That way I can do it straight like that because if you do it like this, don't really, it doesn't really work the same. Like the paint comes down too far. Like So brushing it all forward and then I'm going to part it where I don't want it dyed so the part that you don't want dyed usually you tie back get it out of the way so it doesn't get dye on it oh that's done and then what you're gonna do is just put your gloves on first that's first thing then you kind of just go at it. I don't not one of those people that like parts it first. I kind of just go. Maybe that's why my hair always looks like shit after. But I just go straight at it. I don't do anything different. So Okay, here we go. Okay. So I think I'm going to do pink on the top to do pink on the top to about here then yellow on the bottom and I'm gonna be using gloves and I only have these two so Time for the pink now. Oh god, I'm nervous. Bucket. And always when you're dyeing your hair, you make sure you flip it up because there are very high chances that you do not get the back at all. So make sure you get both sides. as you can see I have dye on my forehead but I probably won't even wash it off to be honest anyway, we'll have a little bit of orange in it we'll just go like that that'll look cool it's kind of like orange but fuck it I love this oh my god God, oh, I'm so excited. Okay, so once you're done dyeing your hair, not dyeing, 
you are going to clean up, or else your mom's going to get mad. Uh, clean up, and then what I like to do when I take my gloves off is just a tip, is just like flip it completely inside out. Grab the other one and flip that one inside out, and there's like no mess. This is all like on the inside. So clean up, leave your dye in for however long you normally leave your hair dye in, and if you've never dyed your hair before, uh, it kind of depends on the brand you're using. Check the label, but usually if they say like 20 minutes, go an extra 10. It's basically just go an extra 10 on everything, unless it is permanent dye. If it's permanent dye, do not listen to me about that. You do what your box instructions say. But semi-permanent, really can't damage your hair so it's like leave it on overnight if, if you want whatever so i'll be back when i'm done and i will let you guys see what's up guys i'm back uh it's been about an hour and a half since i put the hair dye on uh as you can see it's still very orange and purple and pink and i'm really excited about it um it's not originally what I wanted. Originally, I wanted yellow and purple, but, or pink, but I fucked up, but I think this looks a little bit better. So, I'm going to go wash it out and clean my forehead off, and I will see you guys when I'm back. Bye. So, this is the finished result. My hair's still wet, so I won't know the true color till it's dry, but it is did go the color that I initially wanted it. I wanted it to be a light pink up here and a yellow down here, but I guess while it was dying it looked purple and orange. But, you know, this is the color I was originally going for. I kind of liked the idea of the orange more, but I guess I will live with it and I will have to touch it up very soon because I miss a lot of spots. Like, some spots have yellow without pink, and some spots have pink without yellow. So, I will have to do that again soon, and I will post a picture of me, or a video of me redoing it. And I honestly will probably do that in, like, a couple days, because this is going to wash out really fast. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, I will see you later. Bye!